I'm probably going to piss a lot of people off by saying this, um, especially those people who have been in the fitness and nutrition industry for quite a while. Um, I have worked in nutrition and fitness for about 13 years, sorry, 14 years. Anyway, after a certain point, you kind of stop keeping track of time. But something that I have noticed that has been kind of weird and frustrating the whole time that I've worked in this industry is this idea that the skinny you are, the skinnier that you are, the healthier that you are. And that's kind of something that I've seen for a long time. People come in and they say, my doctor told me to lose weight so that I can address this health problem. And um, I want to lose weight so that my, you know, my body feels better. And there's nothing really wrong with wanting to lose weight. That's totally personal and it's up to you. But the problem that I've, that I've seen is that people think that losing weight is going to fix all their problems and it won't you can be healthy or sick at any size you can be a fat person and have beautiful lab work nothing going on with your a1c um, you can be a skinny person have really high cholesterol all kinds of blood sugar problems i have seen it all and I have noticed that sometimes when somebody is at a heavier weight or in a bigger body, sometimes they have some of those lab markers that we associate with not being so healthy. And sometimes someone's in a bigger body and has excellent metrics of health. They have no blood pressure problems. They have like a normal heart rate. They have beautiful labs. On the flip side, I've, I've seen skinny people who have, they're basically just a walking corpse. They're like, their inflammation is just out of control, high cholesterol, um, really high resting heart rate, um, can't get proper sleep, bad lifestyle choices, um, bad dietary choices. It just really seems unfair to look at someone in a bigger body and say, you are unhealthy or assume you eat cheeseburgers at every meal. You'd, you've never even seen a vegetable. That just seems to be something that a lot of people in my industry kind of assume when somebody walks in and they are living in a bigger body. Uh, this happens a lot in doctor's offices, in emergency rooms, and it affects the care that these people are given. They deserve better care from not just personal trainers and nutrition coaches like me, but doctors, nurses, uh, you name it. Uh, we need to stop letting uh, our uh, internalized fat phobia uh, affect how we treat people and the kind of things that we think about them. So can we just kind of interrupt those thoughts as they enter our heads? Because we've been acculturated to them, we've been taught all these things and had them reinforced for years and years and years. And those thoughts are going to pop into your head because we're humans uh, and we've been exposed to that for such a long time. But can we interrupt those thoughts and recognize that somebody being at a heavier weight does not mean that they are unhealthy. They might be cofactors, they might exist alongside, but they are not always just linked together. So we can be a big person who has all the markers of health, or we can be a big person who has all the markers of not having very good health. And the same thing can go for a thin person or just a medium sized person. So I hope that you are feeling the same way that I'm feeling about this. I think that something needs to change. I know not a lot of people want to hear this kind of thing. Um, 
And once again, if you're somebody who's wanting to lose weight, it's not wrong to want to lose weight. It's just that people assume that that's going to fix all their problems. And a lot of times the things that you do to lose weight are things that help some of these uh, things like blood sugar control, hormone balance, all of that stuff. But losing the weight is not the thing that helps fix those things. It's a thing that happened alongside those other things, fixing the blood sugar, or fixing uh, inflammation in your body. It's something that happened as those things were being addressed that is just a side effect. It is not a cause. Oh.